can see, we had to fare in the whole boat because we had a bunch of little pin needles and the cracks in it from the gel coat. So we got done doing that. The guys are mixing up our primer slash barrier paint right now. That's what that noise is in the background. I know it doesn't look like it, but we finally sanded it all down yesterday. It's all smooth. It doesn't look like it, but as you can see, all these little holes are filled. So we're getting ready to put our primer slash barrier coat on and start painting the bottom. Finally, hopefully nothing goes wrong this time. Fingers crossed. And we'll have a pretty bottom by the end of it. So we found a way where we didn't have to wait for the whole rudder to dry to paint the other side or to paint one part where we had to sit where we had it sitting on wood blocks. So Matt had the genius idea, the hanger. There's a little hole in the shaft part of the rudder and we tied this line through it and around on these blocks the hanger and she's completely suspended. That way we can paint this part underneath it, all around it without having to move blocks. So, pretty freaking smart, I think. So yesterday we started um, painting the first coat of Anna Fallon on and we got mostly done with the starboard side. Um, then the sky opened up. Welcome to South Florida where it rains every day and you can't prepare anything. But what we have to do today is um, where it's all gray, where we had missed or we couldn't get to because of the rain. We have to go and sand that down, sand the keel down with 80 grit is what is recommended by Interlux. And then we will put one coat on. Then we have to wait 16 hours to put the next coat on. Then we have to wait 16 hours to put the next coat on. So every coat we have to wait 16 hours uh, due to the type of antifallon we're using, which is a hard antifallon. So, um, We've got to sand the rest of the starboard side and then we have to move over to the port side. Once that's sanded with 80 grit, we'll be able to start painting again. Thank you. 
still have the black anti-fallon paint on I know I'm probably saying that wrong sorry if I am but today we are putting today we are putting the first coat of our blue paint on the bottom which that will be the final color for new beginning is blue on the bottom so excited to see what it looks like so let's get right to it <laughs> so I'm mixing our blue paint up and I have to show you all this because normally Matt mixes the paint up and so far it's been a primer and then it's been black so eh, not that exciting. This blue though is so pretty. I'm so happy we picked it. It's gonna look so good on the bottom of New Beginning so I just have to show it off because it's making me really really excited and then I don't even care I'm super giddy because this just means we're getting a step closer to getting her back in the water so I'm getting even more excited but y'all this blue is so pretty. <laughs> Be sure to follow along with our adventures by subscribing to our channel. If you'd like to know when we release new videos, click that bell. If you like this episode, be sure to give us a thumbs up and comment down below to say hello. Thanks for watching, y'all.